resistance to um, vaccination and the vaccination drive, how was that going? I mean, I believe because there were spurts of resistance to, uh, you know, people, one saw how people were protesting, uh, you know, wearing masks and the impositions uh, put down by the government on, on vaccination and such like. What was, is that, how was that? I mean, is that um, only in certain pockets or was that more? Well, maybe 20, 30% of the people are not vaccinated because they think that, uh, uh, Perhaps, uh, you know, they are uh, healthy, they don't require it, the danger for uh, the younger people is uh, minimal. And then there is a lot of resistance to the idea of vaccinating young kids, because mm. there are some people in the medical establishment who want kids uh, as young as five to mm. be vaccinated, or perhaps even younger. So there is tremendous resistance to that idea. Uh, but we don't know. I think uh, there are a lot of different opinions and some people are more alarmed mm -hmm. about, uh, about COVID than some others. Mm -hmm. and, um, and as we know, there's been this uh, celebrated case of Novak Djokovic in mm -hmm. uh, Melbourne, Australia, who has not been vaccinated. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, there was this whole drama of uh, his uh, immigration uh, hearing and all that. So there are a lot of people who, for various reasons, and some for medical reasons, don't want to be vaccinated. Mm. But, but a vast majority, I believe, are mm. maybe 60, 65%. It's a random number. I don't know the exact figure. Um, my next question, uh, Subhashi, is to do with this term RQ. I mean, it caught my attention. <laughs> It's a term that I haven't come across earlier. Uh, so you're described as an archaeo astronomer. So what does that really mean? What does that entail? Archaeo astronomy is the astronomy at the basis of archaeological sites, of ancient sites, like temples. Mm -hmm. Temples in ancient times were mm -hmm. aligned in the cardinal directions, you know, north, south, east, or west, because east is where the sun rises. So often the door or the entrance to the temple was to the east. Now, these directions have changed because the earth keeps on precessing and it has a period of about 24,000 years. So every 2,000 years, it shifts, this, shifts through one zodiacal sign or every 1,000 years, it shifts through one nakshatra since there are 27 mm -hmm. nakshatras. So you can look at uh, ancient structures and mm -hmm. see the exact uh, directionality of it and try to figure out as to what it might have meant for mm -hmm. the period when it was built. And sometimes there is some um, deviation from that, which has to do some with some astrological factors associated with the king who mm -hmm. paid for the building of the temple. And, and so a lot of history can be extracted. And in India, especially, um, there was also uh, the factor that the very uh, plan of the temple was as uh, mirroring the entire cosmos. So the, um, the distance from the front gate to the mm -hmm. Garbhagriha was taken to be uh, equal to 108 units, which mm -hmm. uh, is something that you already mentioned. Thanks. And the perimeter of the temple was taken to be 360. And 360 is, of course, a very cardinal number. This is the number of days in the year. Mm -hmm. So there was this as well. And then there were other numbers associated with astronomy, which were at the basis of, uh, of the details. Details mm -hmm. also, as we know, of uh, you know, the number of divinities. Mm -hmm. um, in uh, Upanishad, there is a dialogue, how many um, devas are there. Right. And it starts off at 33, but it really, yes. yeah, and, and so on. And finally, uh, three and two and one and a half, because, you know, there is a certain paradox associated with our own conception of who we are, because yeah. if there was only one, then there couldn't be two. So mm -hmm. there is one or two, two, because there is always a separation between consciousness and material reality right okay. but we are also consciousness so it's not just quite two mm -hmm. uh, it's somewhere between one and two please remember to subscribe to us
and switch on the notifications for this channel. For our other social media links, more content and to support our work, please visit citti.net. Dhanyavad. Namaskar.